Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hi my name is Arif Ashraf bin Abdul Rahman so I will representing from my team members which is I will share to you guys about our case study assignments membrane structures This assignment we choose Putrajaya Water Sport Complex or the short form is COSA located at Putrajaya. So this building is specifically for outdoor water sport spectator seat. This building was designed by Seni Bahari Architects which is located at Terengganu. Over the years, COSA has been the venue of choice for various local and international water sports events. COSA was the venue for triathlon, open water swimming, water ski and wakeboard water sports events in the 2017 SEA Games. The Grand Stand, which offers facilities such as media and VIP rooms, accommodates up to 1,000 people and is suitable for hosting both sport event and non-sport events. So we go through to the structural system. For the foundation system it using pre-bore spun foundation. Vibration is relatively minimal decreasing vibration of piles or structure next to them. Usually, for the massive construction complexes where the load of the vertical structures is huge. For the main structure they are using footing root structure which is roof truss, consist of tubular roof truss. Usually used for large span construction such as factories, shopping mall, huge exhibition center. They are generally used for spans as large as 25 to 30 meters. For the substructure of the building it using retaining wall with waterproofing, the foundations and retaining walls are continuously exposed to humidity. In order, to prevent serious damage to the structure of the building and, significant damage to rooms inside, foundation waterproofing or the, other external basement waterproofing is necessary. For the jointing system of the building it is using built-in mast anchor. The tensile is supported by masts, anchors and cables to create precise, membrane glass fiber cloth with PTFE resin coating. The structure relies on central masts and ties with built-in masts anchor, jointing system which distributes tensile forces to the ground. The connectors are made of cast steel which act as central, nodes to resolve and distribute the tensile forces. Dia bagi apa pakai steel structure lah. Steel structure. Ah, steel structure. Dan dia pakai apa yang tube tu? Uh, tak. Kali tengok pula drawing tu lah uh, Steel, steel tube uh. Steel tube uh -huh. This building also have the gutter system which is The gutter or horizontal aluminium part of system that installed along the edges of tensile structure The edge of gutter will connect to the 200 mm rainwater downpipe, to run in column discharge to nearest drainage. Actually, 
Jadi dia projek tu dia sekali dengan apa kompleks kolam renang. Dia kompleks kolam renang pisin 6. Dia ada swimming pool dan grandstand untuk sky. Itu yang yang you tengok tu betul lah. Dia punya grandstand je lah untuk sukan air. Kita cuma setakat meneruskan pelan. Dia orang submit pelan, kita tengok. Kita pelan-pelan yang dia submit tu berdasarkan, kita lulus berdasarkan bylaw. UBBL. Daripada bylaw tu yang apa yang kurang, apa yang tak cukup. Itu kita akan komen lah. Dia akan betulkan pelan tu. Maksudnya PBT kat sini apa nama dia? Perbadanan Perjaya. Perbadanan Perjaya. Ini struktur ni tu ni akan pakai untuk tu lah bridge, stadium. So far sebab uh, Perjaya ni projek-projek baru dah tak ada lah. So kita banyakkan uh, tu lah. Uh, apartment apa semua ya. yang projek-projek macam ni kan dah. Kemudahan awam ni dia dah buat semua dah. Cuma sepatutnya perjaya ni ada stadium, ada kompleks sukan yang besar apa semua tu kan. Itu tak dibuat lagi. Itu semua kat bersilim. For material of this building, they're using membrane glass fiber cloth as a roof covering. The gutter system it used aluminium material, and then they're also using tubular steel as a roof structure or the main structure of the building. For the load distribution of this building, as we can see the load of the building structure distribute from the center, and separately to the left. The load will distribute and go to the ground. Other than that, we also had compared this building to another, membrane structure building such as Tabung Haji Putrajaya. Dah. Okay. Uh. Tadi dia macam. Video ke apa tu? Selamat pagi tiba. Tadi dia. Aje. 